find Bigfoot? I felt like Bigfoot. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> so we are up in the mountain, up above Concanoli. Concali, con, con, Canali. You'll get there. So, what do you think so far? I think we're gonna go back home and rest it up for tomorrow, or what's the deal? Oh, uh, when we get to the bottom, we're going left. <laughs> right is home. Back up the hill. Right is home. Left is somewhere else. <laughs> so, all right. Well, let's get some more trail let's time. Do it. First ride down, sorta. We got Zach over here guiding me in on, uh, I don't know, what was your objective here? If you even flex, bro. We didn't have much flex. Yeah, I'm set up pretty tight on the suspension here. Zach, let's talk about those panic attacks. Let's hold on, hold on, hold on. So we went from down there, up, up to here, at a very high rate of speed. Not very high. Not really that high. No. I drive a lot faster than that. But no, he doesn't drive faster. Than that. <laughs> oh. I just, I just want to. Ah. Now that I got my protein for the day. Blind corners. Pin it. Trail riding number one. <laughs> Don't go around a blind corner fast. So I see 2010, <laughs> and if I see the line and we're open, we're gonna start. We're gonna get into it and start drifting around it. Nothing particularly fast. Like there, there's a lot of people out here. I don't want to. Dude, we squirrel. No, this was uh, this was worth the trip, man. This is gorgeous, dude. Yeah, can't get yeah. much more scenic. Yeah, look at that. I know the sun's gonna blow it out, but now Zach did okay considering that uh, the in my this is opinion the first time I've been passenger in roughly five years. And the X3 is without a doubt the worst car around to be a passenger in, and we stiffened the suspension up on it too. An so X3 it's bit driven by Chad. Wait, now that I know the road, wait till you see how <laughs> Now that you've been on it once? Yeah. <laughs> now, hold on, okay, hold on. Public service announcement. One, don't drive fast around blind corners. Two, don't drive fast down blind corners when there's a lot of other people on the trails. And three, don't drive with tread. What was the middle part? Ian, what are we doing? We are correcting an asphalt mistake. An asphalt mistake? Yeah. It was the asphalt mis problem? Well, I mean, this thing just burns rubber like it's nobody's <laughs> business. What do you expect <laughs> me to do? Already, dude. I just got here. <laughs> <laughs> we were good until we got back on the pavement, and pavement's just not where we're supposed to be, apparently. Oh, uh, Chad's here, isn't he? Yeah, yeah. Chad and Kyle. All right, Ian, how'd that go? It's just more a pain in the butt to get to it outside of that. It's I mean, that's your first belt. <clears throat> yeah. Coming from a YXZ. Yeah, they don't do that. <laughs> Walk us through what happened. We were coming yeah. off the dirt trail. You wanted me to pin it on pavement, so. <laughs> I will power you to, to pin it hard on the pavement. So who am I to say no? I, I seem to remember somebody flipping it into two wheel drive shortly before <laughs> yeah, this is like right this may have happened a little earlier it was like right after we did a uh, yeah that may have happened a while ago it was uh we did a little burnout on the, on the asphalt yeah luckily Ian had his belt stored in his savage UTV case so it was readily available had his toolkit in his machine ready to go Couldn't and uh, discovered the simplicity of a can-am change belt tool <laughs> Got this thing back together. Yeah, I mean, it really wasn't that big of a deal. Glad we could be here for your first time, Ian. Yeah. Oh, I left a little blood behind too, so I guess that's oh. Get used to that with your Can-Am. <laughs> that's every quarter. <laughs>
Well, we had one goal. Now it's to go nobody else, where nobody else had. Captain Baklava here has been uh, throwing trees around that have been blocking the road. And uh, we got about, what, three, four obstacles before we were like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we ran into the forest. Yeah. The forest decided to tell us to turn around, so. Yeah. Basically what happened is we were on the main trail that everybody's on and everybody's going probably a little too slow for us. And we decided to go somewhere else, but yeah. got cliffed out and... But, Honestly, that's what I was hoping for. But that view right there. Not all bad, eh? We are in Conconnelly, Conconnelly, however you say it, and uh, found a pretty sweet lookout tower on Funk Mountain. Conconnelly's down there. Hey Ian, you good with the wind and heights? <laughs> well, these timbers look brand new, so we're good. <laughs> I'll let you go one at a time now. Oh, let one. the fat guy go first. All right. Yeah, you're going to sample it for me. All right, I'm good. You're good. I don't know. Where's the door? Door's on your side, right there by you, for that corner. There's Kyle. A little sketchier on this side. The view from over here is pretty rad. What's up, Skip?
drove the uh, tile car up here today. Left the Razor at home this weekend. Riding shotgun to Ian. Pretty rad. This is Funk Mountain. We were supposed to be rained out. It was all supposed to be miserable. But uh, it turned out great. Oh, my God.